Welcome to Solve It with Speed Tech, where I share common knowledge on how to solve IT and media related problems. In this video, I will show you how to transmit internet from an Android phone to a wireless router. In a clearer term, what I want to explain here is simply how to set up a smartphone to share the internet network to the router using USB tethering. Imagine a situation where you use your Android mobile phone as a main internet source to connect multiple devices in a local area network of an organization. Your mobile phone is internet enabled through your mobile data, but other devices and computers in your local area network have access to the internet through your phone. To achieve this, you need an internet enabled phone, a wireless or wired router, a computer with Ethernet port, an Ethernet or LAND cable. Here, I have this TP-Link wireless router. This can be achieved with any wireless router with Ethernet port to receive internet connection. Now, this router is already powered on. I will then connect my laptop and my Android phone to the router. Because there is no internet connection into the router, both my laptop and my phone will not be able to access the internet. I have another mobile phone with an active mobile data. This mobile phone will serve as my internet source first into my laptop, then from the laptop to the router. Now I'm going to connect the laptop to the router using an ethernet cable. Connect one head of the ethernet cable to this particular port of the router. This particular port is used to transmit internet signals into the router while other ports are used to transmit signals out from the router to your devices. Also connect the other end of the ethernet cable into the ethernet port of the laptop. Having done that, the laptop just identified the connection from the router. The next thing is to connect the laptop to the internet using my phone USB tethering. You can also connect the laptop through the phone wireless hotspot, but I will be using a USB tethering. Here on my second phone, I will activate the USB tethering from the phone hotspot settings. Now, because I have not connected the USB cable from the phone to the laptop, the USB tethering is inactive. Once the USB connection between the phone and the laptop is established, the USB tethering will be activated, as you can see here. Enable the USB tethering by turning it on here. With this action, the laptop is now connected to the Internet. The next step here is to transmit the Internet from the laptop to the wireless router. Once this is achieved, any other device connected to the router will be able to access the Internet. To transmit the Internet from the laptop to the wireless router, right-click on the Laptop Internet Connection icon at the downright side of the Laptop Taskbar and click Open Network and Internet Settings. Click on Change Adapter Options. On this network connection environment, there are four different network adapters displayed here. It might not be exactly the same with your computer. Uh, one is my Bluetooth network adapter, uh, followed by the Ethernet or LAN adapter. This third one represents the USB tethering adapter that provided internet from my phone to the laptop. The fourth one is the wireless network adapter. Right-click on the third one here, which is the USB Tethering Network Adapter, and click on Properties to open the Ethernet Adapter Properties. You can also double-click on the USB Tethering Network Adapter and click on Properties to open the same Ethernet Adapter Properties. Once it is open, click on the Sharing tab. Click Allow Other Network Users to Connect Through This Computer's Internet Connection. On the home networking connection, select Ethernet. 
This other one here, allow other network users to connect through this computer's internet connection, is not compulsory. Click OK. Click Close. Also close the network connection environment. What this action simply means is that you have shared the already established internet connection from your phone through the USB tethering network adapter with the Ethernet network adapter of your computer. The laptop's Ethernet network adapter is now sending out internet signals through the wireless router. Any device connected to the wireless router will automatically have internet access. Now on the router, you will notice that the internet connection signal of the wireless router will be active. Also, the website I initially wanted to access with my phone will automatically open because now there is an internet connection on the phone through the wireless router. I believe you will find this video helpful. Try this yourself and let's have your experience in the comments section. Do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and share. Please do subscribe if you are yet to do so. See you in my next video and thank you for watching.